Hi guys, Nisi here. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to cook pilau, like very delicious pilau. And the first thing you need is your pot, your sufuria. And then you had half kg of beef. That's half kilogram of beef. Add some water. There, I added some water. After adding some water, we need to incorporate some spices. So I just added cinnamon. And then add cloves. You see, I added some cloves. The next thing you need to add is pepper. Yeah, that's pepper. And then mix everything together, like stir everything together. The beef, your cinnamon, your cloves, your pepper. You're doing this because you want this beef. When it boils, when it comes to boil, it absorbs all this taste. The taste of the spices, you see. The beef, the broth, everything will have a touch of all those spices, you see. So right now, my beef as boiled so i just need to strain right so strain your beef and then you have your beef separately and your broth separately you could decide to remove the spices or just leave it no harm you see if you have time you can remove them if you do not have time just proceed right next thing we are now going to start frying so i just add in some cooking oil put enough cooking oil right when i say enough pilau needs enough cooking oil you just not put one tablespoon two tablespoon no and then add enough onions enough onions it means i used four four medium-sized onions right so i'm stirring you just keep on stirring until your onion starts to turn golden brown. Note, it started turning golden brown. It's not golden brown. Then add your crushed garlic. Add your crushed garlic. And then add your crushed ginger. You see? You waited for your onions to start turning golden brown. It wasn't golden brown yet. It just started turning. Then you had your crushed garlic and ginger. And then the next thing, you just tie them and let now the mixture start turning golden brown. Like or brown, whatever the color you want. But now you pre-cooked your onions first. And now you see they are all starting to turn. And I guess now you could feel the aroma already coming in. Next thing, you add your tomatoes. Tomatoes are very optional in your pilau. Some people don't really use tomatoes. But me, I use them because I like a moist pilau. Like, I don't like the dry, dry, dry one. You see? So I added my tomatoes. I blended them. Then I added cardamom. That's cardamom. And then I added cumin seeds. Okay, next thing you had your mixed spices or your pilau masala, you know, whatever other spice you'd like to add to your pilau. And then stir everything together. If you didn't note everything that I added, that was blended tomatoes, cardamom, cumin seeds, and my mixed spice, which I used pilau masala. Next thing, I add my pre-boiled beef. You remember? We pre-boiled our beef with other pilau spices. If you don't remember the spices we used, just go back to the video when we started and check it out. So cover. And then what we're trying to do is we're trying to make this beef absorb the new spices. Right? You know, it'll let, just look at it. It looks delicious already. And the aroma is getting more and more attractive so next thing i add soy sauce i added like one tablespoon of soy sauce this is to make my pilau more darker and this is also optional right once you add your soy sauce just make um just tie everything together 
just tie everything together as you can see my mixture is more darker than before after i added the soy so as you know people believe the darker the pillow the sweeter it is i also like the dark pillow not very dark though and remember it's optional the next thing you add is salt the african way we just say add salt to your taste i mean just add enough salt according to yourself right then stir everything together and this mixture is very very aromatic trust you me you just feel like pilau is ready and it's delicious guys if you love this video so far make sure you like subscribe leave a comment below let me know if you're liking this recipe already let me know if you would love more recipes. Let me know if you think it will be delicious. I know it was delicious. I know. Okay. Next thing you add is your rice. I used to be sure rice. You can choose the whatever rice you'd want to use. Different people like different types of rice. So I used pishori rice and once you add your rice and also the amount of rice depends with you know the amount of pilau you want to cook. For me I used one cup of rice like a big cup it was around 700 ml and then cover it. Let the rice also absorb the spices, let it steam a little bit, and then you start mixing, you know, like stirring. Just tie everything together, the rice and the mixture of the beef and all the spices. Hmm, pilau is almost ready. You see, it's dark, it's beautiful, it's moisturized already. And then I may have to cover it again just a little bit for it to like simmer or something. I don't know the best word to use. Then stir it again. And then next step, you add water. For me, I just added like double the amount. You know how we say like if I, if I used one cup of rice you just add like two cups of water so for me i used both water and my broth you see the broth that i strained remember that broth had spices so i'm not throwing the broth away it's part of my pilau so i just added water and i will need to add my broth but Broth is not like extra fluid. Both the water and the broth makes the two cups of rice of water that you need for one cup of rice. But for me, I said I used a bigger cup. Like I was making rice for the family, pilau, sorry, for the family. So I, I made a lot of pilau. And there we are. We have a mixture and it looks delicious wow and then you cover it and let it cook wow there is our pilau it's ready and very moist this is how i like it i don't know about you if you like the dry one try to avoid tomatoes you see my pilau is moist i like it moist and my pilau is ready let's serve and see how it looks like wow mm. very delicious guys if you think this recipe was good and you'd like to try it make sure you like this video also subscribe also comment below if you really did like this video also comment if you'd like to try there was a lot of it and i swear to you it was very delicious and when you try this recipe, you're going to like it. It's very simple recipe 
and you get to eat a very delicious moist pilau and there we are i served my pilau and now i'm ready to eat thank you so much for watching this video make sure you like subscribe and click that post notification for more you know like you'll be alerted for more videos that i post and guys i love you all so much bye